Welcome to my speedrun tutorial for Half-Life 1. So, this is going to be for um, easy difficulty and both uh, scripted and scriptless categories. So, it's kind of a hybrid tutorial for both categories, but mainly for the easy difficulty. So, keep in mind that I will be using Auto Bunyamp throughout the whole run. So, Hopefully you know how to jump yourself with the scroll. If not, there are a lot of uh, videos out there on YouTube that you can look it up on. Okay, so first thing you want to do is open your web browser like this. Then you want to go to speedrun.com slash hl1. This is the official leaderboard for speedrunning this game. So this is uh, the site where you will upload everything you runs when you know how to run it to compete they have a scriptless and a script scripted category um, yeah okay so they also have difficulty here in the same category so it doesn't really matter anymore which one you run so you really want to run easy because it's a lot better in my opinion so that's what we will be doing okay so next up you want to go to resources here then you want to download this gold source package right here uh, it's an only one package that contains uh, auto bunyan and in-game timer and stuff so even if it doesn't matter which one or which category you run scripted or scriptless you want to download this so click it and make sure you own the game on Steam, Half-Life, on Steam, before you download it. So, download it here. Okay, so next up, uh, you want to go into your computer here. And you want to place the Gold Source package that you downloaded on one of your hard drives. I have it on my D drive here, my SSD drive. Like this. So you right click it and unpack it. I won't do it on, on this video because it will take a long time. Hopefully you know how to unpack stuff. Um, it will end up here. The first thing I want to do is rename it because I run both categories. So I don't want to mix my stuff. I want to keep them separated. So you can do this if you want. If you only intend to run one, you don't need to rename it. Okay, so you want to go in here, right click this, Half-Life 1, edit, and run it. Uh, you want to remove this with um, this text. I will include this in the description, so don't panic. Uh, you want to make sure to change uh, this highlighted text right here to your hard, hard drive uh, location. In my case it's D, so I will rename it to the like that also do it here D and here D like that now you press this close it and save <clears throat> okay so next up you want to right click this create a shortcut and drag it on your desktop right there so you want to rename this you want mine is name scripted so i know which one to press uh, okay that's about it for that next up you want to download um, the crosser that i use uh, if you intend to run scripted it's for lining up stuff with your nade and uh, with your trip mine so you want to go to this link let me show you this link i'll include this as well in the description so download it this crosser is made by executable so shout out to him i really like it so once you have it downloaded you want to unpack it and this will appear you want to open this right here and you want to highlight xr 
dot fpr and hold down control and highlight this weapon trip mine and the weapon hand grenade this is the only weapons you need the crosser for uh, you don't need to use this if you are running scriptless this is only for the scripted version so you copy this go into your scripted package uh, into half-life and then into valve into sprite and this is where you want to paste it so save to everything and now you have the crosser for those specific guns which is really good it will make it a lot easier for you okay so last up you need to uh, download my configs of course um, I'll include this link as well of course it got every config I have for both scripted and scriptless so make sure you download it especially for scripted it is really needed for all the scripts I use and I will be showing so you have to use it for this video or this tutorial okay so once it's downloaded this will pop up you want to open it and you want to go into the category you are going to run so if you run scriptless this is what you will be copying so you want to go into your package half-life and valve one right here and you want to copy all these configs over if you intend to run script less um, you do not need to use my config if you don't want to you can remove it or don't copy it over at all but i do recommend using it uh, you can just switch um, the key bytes you don't like by opening this so i use a lot of weapon bytes as you can see like here bind tab weapons and the revolver and so on um, i also have every weapon bound to a specific key like this so it's really good to get used to it will make your runs a lot easier once you get used to it might be hard in the start but it's worth it in the end okay so if um, you intend to run scripted like i'm going to do you want to copy all of this you want to go back and go into scripted and copy all of this and drag it and say yes to everything like that oh yeah so that's it um okay yep that's it so now you just close this and you start the game like this and you are ready to run the game so i'll see you in part two good luck